man. I'm starting to get this feeling, man. People are sending me this message, man. Like someone like the like the Gang Stalker Network, man, or somebody, man, put a hit out on me or something, dude. Uh, I just keep seeing this weirdness, dude. Dude driving by, giving me the gang sign. They're always giving me overheads, droning the hood. Uh, people driving by me, pointing, stopping in front of my house, just staring and driving off. I mean, there's all kinds of odd, like little happenstance, circumstantial, uh, anomalous behavioralisms. Like, uh, on my video where I'm talking about, uh, <laughs> that the fucking damn Gestapo came rolling up on me. I mean, all my videos, I must be pissing somebody off. So, there, it, it looks like they got the street, like, like the streets, get, like there's a hit on me or something, but they're waiting for something, maybe? I don't know, dude. Uh, uh, it's, it's creepy, but, uh, number two here is, uh, I was sitting there, man, I happened to be at the store. And I looked at this paper, man, and it said, Red Wings, prepare for lightning strike. Prep for lightning strike. And then I remember seeing this other video talking about how they convey secret messages in magazines. And I'm like, holy crap, Is are they talking about Operation Lightning Strike where they take out the Patriots and the gun owners and the Constitutionalists and the Christians? Uh, all in one fail swoop, they just come in. Like, we're, we're the red list, basically, you know, and it's funny, they use the red wings, red list, we got Sharia law going on down in, De or down in Dearborn, uh, the SWAT can't go up in there, so who's really running things up in high places these days, it looks like the terrorists done, they, they done took it over, now, the terrorists, since the terrorists done took it over, everyone who's not a terrorist is the terrorist now, so basically, uh, it's a big fuck a rooski. And like I said, that's a lot of conjecture right there about the magazine sending hidden code messages that they're about to do Operation Lightning Strike. They're prepping for it. Uh, and I would have to say what I'm seeing on the streets, I could substantiate that by my testimony. Niggas driving by me uh, doing the gun hand sign shit. Uh, so, yeah, man, it's not good. Not a good sign. And I keep seeing these, these, these uh, aggressively like People feel like they're trying to sneak up on me, man, close enough to do the pow or something, dude. You know what I'm saying? I, it, maybe the maybe the mafia put a hit on me. They're just like, fuck it. Go go, uh, put the gangs on him so uh, it won't look like us. Because, I mean, like I didn't realize. Maybe I did hit the bullseye. Now now I'm fucking marked for death, man. Uh, I, but I felt I was marked for death by the government anyway. So uh, join the club. if, if <laughs> Join the club, friends. Uh, it's nice to meet you. So, uh, uh, you know, it's an honor. It's an honor to uh, play the game of death with you. You know what I'm saying? Not really, but uh, it's not fun. This is sucks. But it is what it is. It's what time it is. Like I said, canary in the coal mine, if I just get smoked by weird means, gang-looking affiliation, or like say that you find me dead and they'll be like, and then they plant a gun on me, sprinkle some crack on me. You know what I'm saying? Or something. I don't know what's going on, but... uh. I'm not liking what I'm seeing here. I'm, I'm getting the omens. They're not like premonitions. This is actual, I, I think, intimidations. You know what I'm saying? And uh, it's it's showing me. It's not. It, it looks like they consolidated and centralized. There, what what differentiates the streets from the government? The police of the government. The the if what if the streets have become integrated into somehow? You know into the mafia of government or something, dude, and they're getting orders from high up, getting green lights, or maybe they even, it's a paycheck, I don't even know, or it's just, maybe it's out of, uh, what's the word I'm looking for here, discrimination, you know, like uh, racism, basically, or like a racist kind of just uh, unnecessary hatred, you know what I'm saying, like a Bloods and Crips type mentality where you ain't, you ain't realize, you know what I'm saying, how, how, they're, how that's exploited against you. You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying you're a bad person for participating in those things. Just if you're in them, man, you got to just walk away from it. You know what I'm saying? I, it just just for your own soul's sake. That's what I'm saying. I'm not saying none of you guys is bad per se. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying we all got brainwashed into setting certain kind of ideologies that are really detrimental. Maybe it might benefit you. But in the long run, it hurts a lot more people than it benefits. That's what I'm saying. That's the truth. And it always benefits, at the same time, the wrong people. The globalists somehow use it to their advantage as well. You know what I'm saying? And that's what I don't like. So, it's nothing personal. Just 
do research into it and see if what I'm telling you is, is a lie or the truth before you try to take uh vindication street justice after me or whatnot, dude. I don't know what's going on, dude. Uh like I said. But you know, it, it, I, I I can get a hint real easy, but it's like, you know what I'm saying? It's like, all right then. It it is what it is, man.